Hey guys, we're back here at Miami Boat Show 2023. Yeah, 2023. I yeah, know by the time you watch this video, it's gonna be 2025, but who cares, right? Still watch it. Anyway, so the thing that got my attention that this thing right there says 100% electric, and I wanna know what that means. So Captain Mike here is gonna give you a full walkthrough of this boat. So Mike, I love being behind the camera because it's easier. It's all right. This is the Elex 8000. It's made by Exshore. We're a Swedish company. This is a 26 foot center console boat. It's 100% electric. And one of the first things you'll notice is we have an open transom. That's done intentionally to allow our passengers to feel closer to nature and hear the water because there's no engine noise, no fumes and no vibration like you experience in a traditional internal combustion engine boat. You notice we have two bench seats here and a table. This drops down into a bed, uh, sunbed if you'd like, or you can remove everything in about five minutes because our boats have a track system and the furniture resides on the tracks. So it's configurable to how you want to use the boat for that day. Going a little bit more forward, we've got a carbon fiber T-top. This can hold a tremendous amount of weight. I've had three full-size adults diving off the top, no issue. And by full-size, what do you mean? 300 pounds each? Ah, it's a couple hundred pounds. Okay, that's little kids, okay? <laughs> uh, you'll notice here on the gunnel, we have this sustainable cork. This is also on the decking. Uh, this cork is harvested every nine years in Portugal. It's made from the bark of oak trees. You shave the tree, mix it with resin, and then form it to fit. So it's sustainable and it does not kill the tree. Up here on the console, you got a 24 inch Garmin touchscreen display. You also have the wheel, bow thruster, and your throttle. So uniquely at Exshore, our boats feature a 24 inch Garmin screen. It's got a traditional uh, high-end Garmin GPS with our proprietary user interface. You can see right now the battery is charging and then you can see our range at that 52%. You have obviously your speed, your direction of travel, and then your three modes, speed, steer, cruiser, and power of silence. That's gonna be eerily familiar to Tesla owners. So we also do the different power modes. Got your radio controls, which you can do here. So it's got a fusion radio uh, with Bowers and Wilkins speakers. Very nice sound system award. Your lighting is also controlled here at the touchscreen. Give you all of your power information, your pumps, your temps, and your alarms. And then right now you can tell that we are charging the boat. We're at 52% battery and our range is at 52.1 nautical miles. This range indicator updates every second and it's a really accurate representation of what you can do with the boat at the specific speed that you're traveling. So you know exactly how much range you have left and like if you're gonna make it back or not, yeah. it's to the second. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, so if I know my destination is 10 nautical miles away, but my range says eight nautical miles, all I gotta do is slow down and my range will go up and I know I'll make it to my destination. How much money is this is gonna consume? Like a yearly cost, maintenance, things like that. Yeah, so unlike an internal combustion engine boat, electric has no preventative maintenance schedule. So right there, that's gonna save you probably an excess of $1,000 per year in preventative maintenance. Then you also have to think about fuel cost. You can recharge this boat from zero to 100% in Florida for about $14, which is about two and a half gallons of marine gas. So you're saving money on maintenance, you're saving money on fuel. Can you trailer it no problem? Yeah, I trailer this with a hybrid F-150, no problem. Wow, so there's no issues of batteries catching fire or anything like that? No, we haven't had any issues with that. What's the MSRP on the, on the boat? So 295 as equipped, but it'll also include a front sunbed, which is not pictured here. At the coxswain station, you have a flip down seat, which is nice if you want to sit down or if you want to stand up, you have a lean bolster and then a footrest. Up on the bow, you got more of the sustainable cork, good seating on the bow and nice storage. Oh, that's how you open it. <laughs> yep. And then this is a real cavernous storage locker where you can put all of your different water sports toys or towels and blankets and things for the day's activities. So when you say 100% electric, what does that mean? Yeah, just think of this boat like a Tesla. So it's got tremendous torque, zero to 20 knots time is four seconds off the line, but it's only electric. So you plug it in at night, charges overnight, the next day you got 100% battery and you're ready for your time on the water. What's the range more or less in terms of miles, like for a fully charged boat, maximum speed? The typical use case for our boat is a day boater, right? This is a cocktail cruiser. You can go out for four to six hours easily of mixed use day boating. 
At cruise speed, so 17 to 20 knots, your range is going to be about 40 nautical miles. At 5 to 7 knots, your range is going to be about 100 nautical miles. And the top end is 30 knots. So it's got a wide variety of speeds and ranges to make your day boating experience pleasurable and you'll have plenty of battery to get it done. Compare this to, say, a gas engine of the same... Well, let's just do this. Go to the back of the boat, I'll turn it on, you can hear for yourself. All right, let's do that. That's it, I don't hear anything. Wow. It's silent. Yep, that's one of the great benefits of our boats. Silent, emissions-free boating. It's a whole different experience, and it's really a nice hybrid of sailing, which gives you that tranquil experience. And then if you want to go 30 knots, and you want to do it quick, this boat will get you there. So how many adults can you safely carry on this boat? This boat has a capacity for 10 adults. Uh, wait, what, 150 pounds or less? That's the Coast Guard standard, yeah. 10 adults or 150 pounds per passenger. Does it suffer if you put a lot of weight on it, it's gonna go slower or the same? I've had 10 full-size Americans on this boat and jumped off on step, no problem. It's got Bro, plenty of torque. 10 full-size Americans, that's like 10,000 pounds. <laughs> <laughs> see, see why it's better to be behind the camera? That's right. <laughs> we have boats in our inventory right now, available for purchase. And we're also making new boats all the time in Sweden and sending them over to the United States. So if you're interested and you're in Florida, contact Nautical Ventures. They're our dealer partner here and they'd be happy to help you out. You do know about the boat. Good job, man. Yeah, thanks, man. <laughs> I try. <laughs> Yay. Yeah, because some people you put the camera on, it's like, oh, uh, it's a boat <laughs> and uh, it's electric. Well, I'm really passionate about this product. So. What is your one liner then? Like, what, what can you tell the people to convince them to buy it? I would just say, hey, Come get underway and experience the extra power of silence for yourself. It'll change your mind. People, what he's trying to say is like, when you get on, a, on the water on a kayak, for example, you hear nothing. Everything is tranquil. Is that how you say it? Tranquil, tranquil yeah. There you go, relaxing. Tranquilo. That's, tranquilo, that's, that's what he means. You know, you're, you're connected to nature and you feel everything. Uh, but it's not a kayak. No. But it's kind of like a kayak. It has 700 equivalent horsepower off the line. Not bro, really a kayak. Bro, have you seen the new kayaks in the market? No, man. Soon they're going to have jet engines or rockets. I, that'd be cool. <laughs> yeah, but like I get it, like uh, silent, like you don't hear the... Don't smell the gas. You don't come off the boat smelling like diesel fumes. And going, what is it, 40 miles an hour? 35 miles per hour, top end. That That is fast. It is fast. For the size of the boat, and it looks nice too. Wow. Sweet. What's, uh, so they're available now, right? So, right now. Cool. We have one next week. Bro, it's late. I'm tired. I don't have any more energy. That's good. How I'm come done. you have energy? What's, what's your secret? All that clean living, man. I know. You're not smelling the feet. But see, you're here next to power things, so they're ruining your happy see, time. There's electric right there. Yeah, but they're not as nice as this one. How'd you like that demo when I turned the boat on? Sweet. That was awesome. <laughs> no, don't stop recording. No idea. Because he said something about being close to nature and all that stuff. Like, I'm doing B-roll. <laughs> <laughs>